I think that from a systemic issue, which I'm sure you've discussed, you know, a lot on the podcast is the element of working remote. And so the fact that we're still in a situation with the global pandemic and everyone working remotely and in San Francisco, nobody's gone back to the office whatsoever. So it's definitely uh, going to remain that way for the rest of 2020 and probably early 2021. I think it's being able to really communicate and lead teams that have worked so well together in person problem solving from a remote vantage point. That's been really challenging from, from what we see companies having to work through. And then also maintaining their current output, given the the top line hit that they've seen. So we've seen a lot of our companies have to look for more creative ways to outsource things that they were solving or part of their processes internally out to either a company like ours or somewhere else that's a cheaper and more economical solution. So I'd say at a high level that it's really just dealing with the effects of COVID. 